okay guys welcome back to my channel so today as you can see we have a new firmware update from the ledger nano s and uh, obviously on the official page of ledger nano s you you have a step-by-step -step instruction of how you can update your firmware of your ledger nano s uh, obviously i will leave uh, the link down below on the on the video description so you can follow that link if you want to uh, to follow the step-by-step -step instruction otherwise you can follow my video and um, do the, the firmware update by watching uh, watching it happen in real time so uh, basically as uh, the instruction uh, says if your ledger nano s uh, has a firmware update lower than version 1.3 then after the update, we will have to re-enter our 20-word seed, uh, 20 word seed, or our phrase with uh, 24, wo uh, 24 words. Sorry. Uh, so just keep that in mind. But uh, if you have the latest version, which is uh, version 1.4.1, then we can uh, basically proceed. Uh, proceed uh, with the update and uh, the update will be straightforward and the first thing we need to do to update our ledger nano s obviously is to open ledger manager if you haven't uh, already installed installed your ledger manager then you can follow the link on the video description and go there and install your ledger manager then after you have installed after you have opened ledger manager then you just connect your ledger nano s via the usb okay and then we must enter our pin code so let me just do that and i will be right back Okay, after we have entered our PIN code, then the, uh, the ledger manager opens up and the first thing we need to do before we begin with the upgrade is by uninstalling, uh, uninstalling the wallets that we have installed on our ledger nano s and you as you can see on my ledger I have the Bitcoin wallet, I have the Bitcoin cash, Bitcoin gold, Ethereum and litecoin i have only these wallets installed on my ledger nano s so first i need to uninstall all of these uh, wallets from here to make room for the new uh, firmware update and the uh, the uninstall is uh, really simple you just click uh, on this uh, icon uh, here which is like a bin or a gray button for the bitcoin it says removing application we just need to wait for it to remove the application then confirm on the ledger processing okay so basically if you get this uh, this message here unable to remove application you cannot uninstall the bitcoin app if other altcoin altcoin apps are still installed don't worry this means that we have to uninstall first the other wallets the altcoin wallets and then we we have to uninstall the bitcoin wallet for last i knew it but uh, i did this on purpose so you guys can see what happens if you do this way so you just don't worry but go ahead and uninstall the other altcoin wallets first and then the bitcoin wallet you leave that for the last okay you click continue and let's go with bitcoin cash since i have this one removing okay and as you can see on my ledger bitcoin bitcoin gold ethereum litecoin the bitcoin cash wallet it's not in here so let me just go ahead and uninstall the others and i will be right back okay as you can see now on my ledger nano s i have only the bitcoin wallet installed 
So, uh, so this is the last wallet that we want to uninstall from our Ledger Nano S. So let me go ahead and just do that. Okay, don't worry if you don't get the approve, uh, the approve uh, uh, message because if you approve once, then uh, the, all the other wallets can be removed um, uh, from, uh, uh, for, uh, from that approval there. So, so uh, the approval doesn't come uh, every time you uninstall a wallet. But, it, uh, but if, for, uh, for example, you unimplug and plug again your Ledger Nano S, then the approval message will come again and you just um, and you just uh, approve it with uh, by pressing the right button on the ledger nano s okay now we have uh, uninstalled all of all of our wallets from the ledger nano s then we go on the ledger managers on the firmware here you can see that we have firmware version 1.4.2 we just click on install here It says installing OS updater on the ledger says processing okay update firmware version 1.4.2 identifier so we confirm it by pressing the right button Okay, we must enter the pin code, so let me just do that and I will be right back. Okay, I have entered the pin code, now let's confirm with the both buttons. It says update installing firmware on the ledger manager processing Okay, now we have to re-enter our pin code. Okay, as you can see now, after the update, something has changed. Uh, before, when I entered my PIN code, when it got to the fifth character, it immediately got to the sign of confirmation. But now, it gets you to a number because maybe you want to set or you have set a PIN code with more than four characters. So, if you get a number here, you just scroll on the menu till you get the confirmation button and then you just confirm okay and now it says uh, install the apps press both buttons to continue okay as you can see now um, uh, now the update uh, has finished let's go and confirm it on settings device firmware and as you can see secure element version 1.4.2 and the MCU must be at 1.5 if you are getting these two numbers 1.4.2 on secure element and MCU on 1.5 congratulations you have just updated your 
Legend Nano S with the latest firmware. Now we can just go ahead and and uh, install back our our wallets. Okay, let's get back here. To install, it's very easy. You, uh, you just click on this button here. It says installing application. Allow Ledger Manager. Confirm it. We just wait a little bit. Okay, now as you can see, the Bitcoin wallet has just installed on my Ledger Nano S. So now my Ledger Nano S is uh, upgraded to the latest firmware update and now I can have my coins uh, secure on my Ledger Nano S so you can proceed as usual with your coins and with your transaction. So uh, uh, as I told you at the beginning, if your Ledger Nano S has a version uh, older than version 1.3 then the procedure will be slightly different so you just make sure to follow the step um, uh, the step-by-step -step guide on the official page of uh, Ledger uh, Ledger uh, Ledger wallet and there you can uh, see what you can do in this case but it's very easy don't worry about that yeah that's it for today guys thanks very much for watching i hope uh, this was clear if you have any question please don't hesitate and ask me and i will do my best to help you out thanks very much for watching again and see you on the next one bye bye guys